Hey guys, it's Jennifer from Breakthrough Maths and today I'm going to be showing you how you would use algebraic long division and in this case to show something is a factor. So here we are asked to show that 2y plus 3 is a factor of 2y cubed minus 9y squared minus 28y minus 15. So here we know that we have to do algebraic long division because we're asked to show that it's a factor. So if it's a factor, that means it will divide in with no remainder. Okay, so to show it's a factor, it divides in with no remainder. So let's test this out. So 2y cubed minus 9y squared minus 28y minus 15, and that's all going to be divided by 2y plus 3. Okay, so we start off with our first term on the outside and our first term on the inside. And we see how many times does 2y go into 2y cubed? So 2 into 2 goes once and y into y cubed goes y squared times because y squared by y is y cubed or y by y by y, so to the power of 3. Then what we have to do is multiply the 1y squared by the 2y and then by 3. So 1y squared by 2y, 2 by 1 is 2, y by y squared is y cubed, then 3 by 1 is plus 3 by y squared. Okay, we draw a line under, that's that part done, and then we change the signs. So then we have 2y cubed minus 2y cubed is 0, and then we have minus 9y squared minus 3y squared and that gives us minus 12y squared and we bring down our next term. So we want to be working with two terms at all times. Then we go back to what we did at the start. First term into our first term here because we don't count the zero. So 2 goes into 12 six times but since it's minus 12 it goes minus 6 times. 2 times 6 is 12, 2 times minus 6 is minus 12. y goes into y squared y times because y by y is y squared. We go back and do what we did again and multiply by the 2y first and then by the 3. So minus 6 by 2 is minus 12, y by y is y squared. Then plus 3 by minus 6y is minus 18y. Again, we draw our line under and we change our sign. So it changes to a plus and a plus. Minus 12y squared plus 12y squared gives us zero. And then minus 28y plus 18y gives us minus 10y. And we bring down our final term because we want to be dealing with two terms at all times. Okay, then we go back to what we were doing again. We take our final term minus 10y and look at our first term on the outside. So how many times does 2y go into minus 10y? 2 goes into 10 five times, goes into minus 10 minus five times and y goes into y once. Okay, then we multiply back out again. So minus five times two is minus 10 by y. Three times minus five is minus 15. We draw our final line under and we change our signs to both pluses and we'll find that this cancels to zero and this cancels to zero. So we are left with no remainder, which shows that is, is a factor. And that's how you do algebraic long division.